hi guys today we are going to see how to find subdomains of that website it means we are in the part of the enumeration part in the enumeration part we are going to see that how to find the subdomains of that particular website and now we are going to find the subdomains of particular website through the tool called fears this means f i e r c fears tool now with the tool we are going to find the subdomains of the website whichever you want to like so let's start with the practicals to find the subdomains list so i am going to type feeds uh, let's see help what the help it is showing and uh, let's type this much information it is there this many, these many comments are there in the face this is nothing but it's a semi lightweight scanner that helps locate non contiguous ip space and host names against specified domains so it does it do some benefits of hacker to perform on the website to find the subdomains list and it is also find the files which is which is misconfigured in the uh, website and uh, it will also find default file is open on the uh, server these all things it will find so let's do the some common uh, scanning through using the fields uh, tool so let's f i e r c fields for dns example what uh, website i have to take microsoft.com microsoft.com is a common website so let's start so it means uh, guys fears have 2280 keywords to perform a brute force attack on that uh, website and it will find the subdomains list including with the ip address also this is a one of the fantastic tool to find the web, uh, subdomains of the any website which is your target or which is your working on the penetration testing to perform so let's hope that uh, we will get much more information about uh, the sub subdomains list it will take time some time to find the list of the subdomains and it will do because it is it is trying to scan and it is trying to brute force on the server to find the subdomains of that particular website now we are going we are doing here microsoft.com website so how many my uh, subdomains are they are using and what are the ips of that websites so these are the things we are going to find here let's see the method uh, how it is working see we got one uh, ip address 734.170.185.46 subdomain is agent.microsoft.com so another another uh, ip also we found and uh, that is also agent.microsoft.com and next uh, 104.215.95.87 the another subdomain is ai means artificial intelligence i think it is not i am not confirm it is i think different different ip addresses are changing you can see here so these are the things we are able to find here and it will collect every information how many subdomains is there in that our server so guys this is the beauty and this is the technique to find the subdomains by using the fees tool in the kali linux so if you do not install the fees tool you will type apt get install fees fees and then it will it will automatically install in your operating system so guys thank you for watching my videos and please subscribe and share my videos and we are going very deeply in the soon because it it is not we are in the basic level so we are going to be in the advanced level very fast so thank you guys